So candidates done the phone interview. Now they are asked to pre be prepared for a face-to-face -face interview. So in terms of preparation, what other preparation they should do that's not relevant in the phone interview and what questions they should ask at the end? Sure. So typically phone interviews can either be one on one or sometimes they'll have just uh, like a panel discussion. So it's really important to understand the nature of the interview that you're going into. Is it just going to be a behavioral or is it going to be technical? Because that will help you to understand what kind of research you need to do mm -hmm. in advance. Uh, one of the other things to prepare for for an in-person interview is the behavioral questions that tell me about a time when making sure that you have solid answers to those uh, and then being able to articulate one, why they should hire you, and two, why you want to work for that specific company. Mm -hmm. Now, in terms of questions that you uh, can ask, I actually have an article that I did with Fortune Magazine that outlines the, 10, the top 10 questions mm -hmm. to ask in an interview, so I can share that with you afterwards. But one of the things that I tell clients is that don't just use the boilerplate you know, tell me about the culture, or tell mm -hmm. me, it, it, one of the questions you should ask is like, well, what are the milestones uh, the first set of milestones you want me to achieve in this role. Yeah. What does success look like? What does an ideal candidate look like? Really get the interviewer to think and then also ask questions about the company. What are the plans for growth? What are the plans for expansion? Mm -hmm. Really show the interviewer that you're not just here to get a job, that you, you're invested in wanting to work for the company. Those are great questions. And please, I will share your article in the comments below. And again, for the audience watching or listening, if you have any other tips in terms of the face-to-face uh, -face interview, please leave it in the comment section. Like and share the video and subscribe to the channel and tune in tomorrow for another question with Julia.